This week on Phoenix TV, we're living the dream in Koh Samui, Thailand. We're doing another episode on luxury on a budget. We live in the island life. On the last episode, I flew from Vietnam to Bangkok to now Koh Samui. Koh Samui is world renowned famous for its clear crystal beaches and there are many of them. Just look at that view. Wow. And if you don't like Koh Samui for some odd reason, you can easily hop on a boat, go to another island, and go to that beach. Simple as that. Everything and anything is possible in Thailand. Whether you want to go shopping, try all the foods, explore the nightlife, or just kick back and relax. Don't worry, I cover it all. So be sure to subscribe and follow along for more Thailand videos. I just got picked up at Koh Samui Airport in a limousine bus and this is what it looks like. There's a spaceship up in here. And I can put up my feet but I won't because I'm not rude. And two cup holders and a bunch of um, snack tray. Yep. And if I don't like looking at people, I just... Oh, I didn't see you guys there. What's up everybody, it's your boy Fee for Phoenix TV and as you can see, I'm not in Toronto. I am in the famous island of Koh Samui. Oh, you wanna see what an island house looks like in Koh Samui? Let me show you real quick. Just so you know, I've lived in here for about almost a week now, so pardon the mess, but this is the double door to my villa. This villa is called Patiman Cottages Villas. And here you go. Here is space for your luggage, and here is a smart TV, which they provided you with. All comes with Prime Video, YouTube, Apple TV, Disney, and so much more. This is the lounging area of the living room. And also, if I wanna turn on the fan and not use AC, I can turn it on no problem with this handy dandy switch. If it's red, it means it's on, I think. Anyways, you can, tr you can uh, adjust the velocity if you would like. This is, the, this is the lounging space. Very, very comfortable. I like it. And over here is if you would like to work, study, do some stuff, or just simply eat some mango sticky rice, which I have right here, which I have to say, if you're in Thailand, you have to eat mango steak and rice. I know it looks kind of like, why are you eating rice with fruit? Trust me. Mm -hmm. The mangoes here, way different. Over here, you have the first bedroom, which I slept in. I know it's kind of messy, but big space. You can, you can have, uh, you can block this vision of the roof as under construction, no problem. And then you hop over here. Here is the master bedroom, right here. It's pretty spacious. I know what you're saying. Oh, there's not enough daylight. No, there's too much daylight. That's why I blocked it out because I can't sleep when there's sun in my face. There's so much sun, and there. I know there's one thing you got. You, you're gonna ask me. V, how come the floor is kind of dirty? It's not dirty, it's made of rock. So that's just the way that everything is designed here. Like this washroom right here. There's no door, it's just, there's no door, it's just the corner. But it's made out of rock, solid, you know? Before bricks and everything, rock was there, cement was there. So utilize what you have, guys. So over here is the fabulous kitchen, the kitchen. You have the stainless steel. You have a little sink right here. You can wash your dishes while admiring the mountains of Koh Samui. And then you got your own propane gas stove, which is pretty neat. Not gonna lie to you. Toaster, coffee maker, and a kettle. And a washing machine, which you can put your towels in as soon as you come back from the beach, which is basically right there. Like five minute walk is right there. Over here, you have the balcony for lounging, right here. Lounging, and then you can hang your clothes. So, you guys wanna move to Koh Samoa yet? The, the, the atmosphere and the weather here is consistently 
is consistently calm. Like, I have to say it's calm. It's not too windy, it's not too hot, it's not too warm, like it's nice. And the thing is, it's consistent. You're never gonna get like, oh, tomorrow's a rainstorm, tomorrow's gonna snow, tomorrow's gonna be hectic. You don't have none of that. So that's one thing about Koh Samui that I really like. But yeah, this is basically it. This is basically the small two bedroom, one bath of the Patiman cottages. So without further ado, let me take you to the beach. But before that, make sure you subscribe, like, and comment, and let me know what you think about this villa because I'm living in this for a week and uh, yeah, I like it a lot. So um, yeah, I will let you know my first impressions of Koh Samui and definitely the house is uh, not bad. It's definitely very, very affordable. I got this villa for the price of, and that is all you need to know. I'll catch you in a little bit. Subscribe, like, comment, it's your boy Fee. Phoenix TV and I'll see you in a little bit. Peace. I got some food. Oh yeah. Alright everybody, I got some Thai milk tea right here. I got some chicken pad thai with a lot of Thai spice. Look at that. A lot of Thai spice right there. You can literally smell it.